Hi, this is Noah Mikesh. I'm a first year student at Newman University, the athletic training program, and uh, this is my coronavirus story. Um, nothing crazy has happened for me or my family, really. Like, there's been no cases. It's just more of, like, kind of more worrying about my family. So my younger sister, who actually is going to Newman next year, uh, Bridget, she has a disease called cystic fibrosis, which is pretty much just a respiratory uh, disease. Not like lung cancer, but more of just like still affects the lungs and it's really bad. Um, for her, being like athletic, playing field hockey and ice hockey and just soccer all her life, and she's on the new medicine, she's healthy, so that's good. But there's other cases that are really bad. So whenever she gets like the common cold or just like the sniffles, it's 10 times worse for anyone with it. So when hearing about a possible pandemic happening, I was super worried, so I even told my parents I wasn't going to come home at first. I stayed at Newman University in my dorm room for two or three days until they told me I had to leave school, like it was canceled. So I left, and I pretty much self-isolate in my room. I don't really see my sister that much. I do, obviously for dinner, but like I don't like hang out with her as much because whenever someone has to go out of the house to get something, I don't want my mom or my dad to get sick because they're around 50 to 55. They're at that rage where it's like, that's not good for their age. So I go out of the house for stuff. I go to shop, right? I do this and that. So I'm the one who goes out of the house and like gets everything for everyone. So no one else gets sick. Thankfully, knock on wood, I have not gotten sick yet. I've had a cough, but nothing crazy. And yeah, like, I just kind of self-isolate myself so no one in my family gets sick. Like, I wear the mask, I wear everything. So it's more of just, like, my story is trying to be precautious for other people around me. And I feel like that's what everyone should be doing. Like, if you go to the house more than once a week, you should try and do kind of the same similar thing to just self-isolate for at least, like, a few hours or a day to make sure you're not sick. Because even, even healthy people can carry it. So it's more of just be precautious. Because in my county alone, for New Jersey, the three towns next to me, it's I'm in Tons River, Brick Township's next to me, and Lakewood is on the other side. Our three towns have combined like 4,000 cases, and it's rising every day. So it's like the more I go out, the more risk I have of bringing it home. So I've tried to stay home and not go out as much as I should but then again I have to for stuff like if we're out of supplies for like food like if we run out of food we gotta go to shop right that's a given so it's just more of like just I'm just trying to tell everyone to be precautious if you go out make sure you wear your mask make sure you wash your hands literally every single time you can <laughs> and just you know, be wary because even if you don't get sick like you can get others sick that's like what I'm trying to say. Yeah. Thank you for listening. And uh, yeah.